Okay, uh, so I think I'm live. Everything... It looks like I'm live. But Twitch Inspector doesn't see that I'm live. Um, so I'm just a little concerned here that... Uh, I might not actually be live. Twitch support. I'm just going to quickly check here. Uh, da -da -da -da, we recovered. That's March 10th, so that was a few days ago. I don't see anything saying everything's all fucked up, so I'm going to assume that all is good. Um, yeah, I mean, it shows on Twitch for me, but it also doesn't say that I'm live in Twitch Inspector. Which is strange. Um, anyway, whatever. Uh, so, the last time, I've got to get myself set up here properly, um, last time we were sneaking through the castle, we weren't able to directly go up to the, hey Emily, okay, so I am actually properly live, <laughs> I was, I was just, uh, trying to figure out if I actually was, because Twitch Inspector wasn't showing me as live. And it was doing weird things with the stream title because I had updated it earlier and it didn't get updated properly. So I don't know. Anyway, given that you're here, I assume that uh, I am at least showing up for you. So I believe there was a guard up here. Um, yeah. Hmm? Yeah, we've been spotted. Halt, scoundrel. Wait, what? Okay, yeah. That's fine. I just wanted to remind myself that there was, in fact, a guy up there, so we can't go up that way to the elevator. Presumably, we will... I, f I figured I was, because I could see myself on my side. But I was only slightly certain. <laughs> but welcome. Uh, okay, so... <laughs> located gondola switch. We call the gondola. Go all the way up. And then cross the bridge to the other side. So what's the deal here? A cable. Looks to be a bit frayed. It's a big machine. A single lamp is shining faintly. What could it be indicating? And then that has wires that run into the water. A small device connects the cables to the pool. Looks like it might be used to conduct something from within the pool. A pool. Cloudy water makes telling the depth hard. A dark silhouette is faintly visible. Oh, okay. Whatever. Uh, we want to go to the roof, because we got to go back basically the way that we came earlier. We go up, over, and around. Huh? That's weird. Power source is completely drained. Therefore, who's there? A guard approaches. Hiding immediately is recommended. Yes. Over here. We're going to go under the thing there. Yeah. <laughs> the eyes. Hey, who's down there? That's strange. Nobody's here. Was it you, Billy? Maybe you're hungry. Compartment. This is so hard to understand. It's full of useless information. Billy, come out. Won't take his medicine, won't eat his food. If you don't eat, you'll die. Okay. A bag that says fish feed on it. In it are dried grains with a peculiar smell. Sure, let's take some. Wait, what the fuck is this? Dumb snapper. Oh, that's the thing that we had earlier. Uh, okay, so why don't we... It smells of fish, too. We use that on there, although will I really do anything? It doesn't seem to do anything for him. Uh, 
The feed was spat out. Okay, well, let's look at this book or whatever it says. The title says Fish Lovers Magazine. Is this uh, the novelization of The Shape of Water? Read it? All right. Fishing news. Dear readers, are you fishing? Here are the news from Vegetable Village. An accident got me depressed, but a mysterious green man and his friends helped. And now for my usual report. Catch the shy Xander. How to catch shy Xanders easily. This will teach you the basics. Jet bass snapshot. An article about photography. A fish called jet bass is the subject. Backfoot buddies. A comic strip about fish called buddies. Just as the little buddy is about to strike the big buddy, this month's episode ends. Fish question panel. Ask Mr. F. My fish won't eat or take its medicine. Well, that sounds exactly like what um, that guy said. That's bad, but there's a simple solution. Just mix the medicine with the feed. It's easy to mix feed with liquid medicine. I'm sure your pet will be better in no time. Okay, well, we have medicine. Uh, so just pour that right in there. That doesn't look good. Mix the feed with miracle medicine. Strange smell arises. Alright, we got some special feed. Let's try the special feed then. There's a mysterious scent. Wow, what is that? A large fish rose out of the water. This must be Billy. Hey there, Billy. A large fish. Is this Billy? Uh, how, how, how about we have her find out? <laughs> large freshwater fish. Electric catfish. Okay. <laughs> Whenever it experiences an external stimulus, like its skin being rubbed, it will emit electricity. Uh, can we poke it with the straw? Is that good enough? Here I go. Did I do well? Okay. Well, it's an electric catfish, so we could use our rubber gloves to rub it. Rub it down. Use the rubber gloves. This is a good sign to me. Oh wait, oh I have to actually rub it myself. Okay, I have to touch it on the touch screen. That was not what I was expecting. There we go. We got some juice. Yay, the lamp went on. Will the gondola work now? Uh, that seems bad. <laughs> It's overheating from the immense electricity. We must use the gondola now, before the equipment breaks down. Repeat. We must use the gondola now, before the equipment breaks down. Okay. Let's go to the roof. Yeah, that was quite a fish. Um, mister, it doesn't move. Oh, it's gonna go. Oh, it went boom. <laughs> the music sounds far too intense for this. Touch. Seems like a good idea. The cable's broken. It's leaking electricity. Uh, okay, well, I guess it didn't die. Cable isn't long enough to connect. Okay. This should bridge the gap. Why don't we have her look at it? 
part of the high voltage cable has been damaged. <laughs> to repair it, a length of some kind of metallic conductor is needed. <laughs> I have decided on a way to repair the cable. Get in the gondola. Okay. Dingle. Of those who are here, who's the smartest? The one excelling in style and function. Who of the following would that be? Fucking clearly it's Billy. The answer to that question is, I am. However, I have learned a lot during the last days. Kakashi. Yes? Go with Tingle. Huh? Okay. Miss Bariki, is something wrong? Tingle. Back at the cornfield, you recovered my batteries. Thank you. Oh no! Miss Bariki! She'll be fine. Uh, ahem, can you see me? This is not a transmission. It's a recorded message. Should this robot behave in an outrageous manner, I beg of you to kindly overlook it. You see, it doesn't have a kindness circuit. The usual robots are equipped to understand. Human emotions like joy, anger, and sadness. This is one first has to learn all of these. If my calculations are correct, I expect that this robot will be able to achieve great things. Wait, is is that love ya? Did love ya become or because this is that doctor Doctor G or whatever? Did he become love ya? I am Doctor G of Orbital Industries. Yeah. I am this robot's father. Ah, uh, ahem, can you see me? This is not a transmission, but... Obi-Wan Kenobi, you're my only hope. Alright, so we have made it up to the top. We got a guard here. Ah, it shut down again. I wonder if she's okay. Hmm, someone there. Sneak out. Weird, no one here. Well, what was that? Is that dark time sneaking mission now? Oh, just this. Oof. Darn these windows. I feel like I missed my opportunity to escape here. Come on, why won't you go on? There. The wind has gotten so strong. Chapter 4, I understand. Okay, so we gotta get past that dude. Um, I'm thinking... <laughs> the bird in the background. I'm thinking I could open that window again, maybe. Um, but honestly, I don't know what else there is in this area. Can I open this again? There's a window. You can hear faint wind blowing through a gap. Might as well try. I don't think we'll be able to. Who's there? Okay, so he'll go over and investigate that, and can we... Strange. Could have sworn someone was rattling the shutters. Oh, but could he maybe only hear it? This is no good, mister. This shutter's too rusty and squeaky. Yeah, but what if we oiled it? Because we do have oil here. So then he might not be able to hear it. He poured oil on the shutters. Okay, now we try and open them. Perfect. That blows out the torch. 
Ah, went out again. Can we get past now? I don't believe this. Why won't it go on? Alright, there we go. Oh fuck, is it locked? A key. Brazier is not lit. Okay, I was trying to click on the soldier. And then, what if I had Kakashi? Straw, but how? Okay, well, I was hoping that he would maybe uh, be able to. Not sure what to do. Uh... I obviously don't want to speak to him. Seems like it'd be a poor choice. What if I shot him in the head with a slingshot? Huh? What's that? Nope, that didn't work. Halt, scoundrel! <laughs> I mean, I guess he's wearing a helmet, but... You never know. Maybe it was going to be a strong shot and it could knock him out. Okay, so how do we get a... I assume he has the... Oh, okay, it even just resumes here. What if we just tried to... Talking to him doesn't seem like it would be the right choice. <laughs> uh, what if we covered him in oil and... He set himself on fire when he finally got the torch lit. What if I just examined him? A guard. He's concentrated on getting the fire going. Uh, fishing rod? Nope. Kakashi can't pick locks, right? Well, okay, let's just try talking to him. I don't think that's the right answer, but you don't want him to notice you. Okay, good. Let's examine it. There's a door. You can exit from here. You don't have a key, right? No. Can we go out the window? window. The night wind is blowing in incessantly. Wait, we can open it again? The window suddenly... That's weird. Mm. Locked. A key. So we gotta get the key off of this guard somehow. I assume. Because I don't... I can't, like... Okay, yeah, that gets us spotted. Basically, I can't... The oh, There's only a few spots I can go here. And only so many things I can interact with. And I'm not seeing a... Oh, hold on. We can interact with the shelf, which I didn't. Oh, we can push this down onto him. All the things on it looks ready to topple. There we go. Yeah. I thought I had tried to click on that before. Ugh! Alright, you just fucking murdered that guy. Poor guy, eh? Alright, now we can... It's not up for conversation right now. Guard is unconscious. There's a key on his belt. It might be useful. Take it with you. Fuck yeah. There we go. No, no, I didn't mean to click on that. Totally just murdered that dude. He deserved it. He was stopping us from going to the ball to dance with the princess. That's worthy of taking his life. Alright, we unlocked the door. Now, hopefully the bridge is actually extended out here. It is not. Mechanical bridge operated by crank. Something's sticking out at the end of the bridge. Something's supposed to be latching onto it. <clears throat> I don't think I'd be able to do anything with the slingshot here, but like we might as well give it a shot, right? 
There wasn't a crank on this side. No. Connector. Fits into the latch on the other side. Hey, raw man. <laughs> Chaotic neutral. Uh, hmm. I feel like I'm going to need to use my fishing rod at a distance here. Either on this. You tried, but it's no use. Or on this. Nope. How the fuck do I get across this gap? Do I have to go back to the previous chapter? Is he just jerking it there? What the fuck is going on? What is that animation? Holy shit. Um, I feel like maybe I have to go back to the previous chapter and open that bridge again in the thereafter. This chapter started in the previous room. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think we have to go to the, I think we have to go to the next, previous chapter and then get here somehow. Yeah, that was definitely a jerking it animation. Like, am I wrong? At least playing with himself through his underwear. So yeah, I'm I'm about 90% certain that I have to go back here and extend that bridge. Wow, well, the princess got well. Now we can all get an audience. Blah, 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 blah. Even though it didn't seem like we could actually get into the castle in any way, or like, or like anywhere in the castle in this chapter before. Testicular adjustment animation. Yeah, but that was an awfully long testicular adjustment. I'm wondering if... <laughs> you don't know that there's not a hole cut out underneath underneath the red uh... also he just went to adjust his underwear there uh, you don't know that there isn't a hole cut out underneath the red underwear okay so if we go through here A uh, powerful drive for action now. I didn't mean to click on him. Uh, no entry. What? is resting. No entrance. something from outside maybe can I get was there there wasn't a previous chapter before this that was in the city also right Oh, I see. You may not enter here. Follow the yellow road to enter the castle. Let's go back to... Well, let's have a look here. 
I don't think there's another chapter or another page that I can go to that is in the city here. Yeah, that one's in the desert, so no. So if we go back here, we'll end up at the top of that gondola. We'll have to murder that dude again. That ran out of juice. Hmm, someone there? Unfortunately, we have to sit through all this cutscene again. Weird, no one here. Oh, just this. Because I feel like this is all like a pretty long amount of cutscene here, which is annoying. Darn these windows. Oh, maybe that little backpack? There's a little backpack on the left side of that shelf. There. I wonder if that falls off and it's maybe got a... No, a parachute wouldn't be useful, but like maybe we can, maybe we can pick something up that was on that shelf. Um... After we knock it down. Alright, chapter four. I understand. The other thing is that we haven't... Uh, I didn't seem to... Well, maybe I just need to... See what Kakashi can do. I Like, maybe he can get... Th maybe we can throw Kakashi across the gap or something. Um, I don't really know how we do that, but... Like, then, if we had someone over there, we'd be able to, uh, wind the thing and, uh, get the bridge across. Okay, so now we knock this down. Okay, yeah, so those things definitely fell off, and that bag does look suspiciously- Oh, and there's even rope here. Thick, sturdy rope is lying on the ground. Yeah, okay, so let's take that. I guess I just didn't click around in here enough. Maybe that just that... Yeah, I think this is just the dude. Guard is unconscious. Oh, I guess we still have the key. Which I suppose technically means we didn't need to kill him again. But I'm glad I did, because it was fun. Um, okay, oops, shit. So yeah, let's use this. Wait, is this still open? No. Oh, maybe we need to have... Yeah, we probably needed to have looked at the door before we can find the key on his body. Yeah, okay. So now we got the key. We've got... Knocked over shelf. Its contents is strewn across the floor. As opposed to are strewn across the floor. So now we'll use that tower key. Get out here. And now that we have the rope, maybe we can get that across somehow. Maybe if I threw the rope to there... Okay, yeah, here we go. And then we'd probably be able to send Kakashi across. We... Oh, maybe we... It's long enough, but it can't cling to anything. Too bad, the rope won't stick. Hmm, what should we do? Okay, so we need to make it... We either need to make it sticky... Yeah, we can't... Okay, so what if we... It looked like it had a little, uh, where's that rope? Where the fuck is the rope? Oh, 
It looked like it had a... Uh... Okay, we can't do that. So we definitely need to throw it onto here. So maybe we need to... Yeah, I'm wondering if maybe we can pull out this, uh, the thing on this side. I just had a great idea. How about tying me to the end of the rope? There. Try throwing it again. Okay. We got the Kakashi rope. Okay, so I was like half... Well, actually, no, I guess I was 100% correct. The answer is to throw Kakashi across. Yeah, I was I was kind of concerned about something like that too. It's like, oh, I missed it earlier in the chapter, so I'm fucked now. I've got it. I've got it, but can't fasten the rope like this, so hurry up and come over. Uh, do I have to click on the rope? Walk the rope to the other side? Yeah. This is gonna be. Okay, so basically I just have to tap forward and then touch the touch thing to make sure I don't fall. Okay, we made it. You did it, mister! My, my hands! My hands are getting numb. Alright, we'll pull them up. Oh, what? Oh no! This is stop! What now? Think of something. How about... Mister, I... I know it. Can I do it? No! <laughs> Mister, I can't hold out much longer. Is it okay if... Okay, yeah, he wants to just let go. Look, mister. This is for the best. Oh! And... That is two guards now murdered. Uh, because this one... Well, this one's for sure dead. Oh, come on. Let's be real. That guy is dead. Oh, we can murder him now. The bridge controls are locked, though. Could have crushed him with the bridge. That would have been amazing. Cut him in half. You there, the middle-aged man. You're so old, yet you look ready to cry. Go down the stairs. You're almost there. Perk up, you 35-year-old man. Everyone's rooting for you. Tingle's always a hero. Let's be real. What? He, he's all sad. The brazier is lit. We're not perked up. Oh, yes. And I will need to update the milestone command because I have now come up with a... Uh, A subscriber goal. Although I'm not, sh I'm not sh I think 30 is probably good, but maybe I should make it 40. I'm still not sure. To, uh, um, do the 100% on the first Tingle game to get that happy ending. <laughs> Proceed this way to reach the ballroom. Go, Tingle, but stay alert. Stay safe. All right, here we are. We're all sad and mopey going into the ball. Mister! The ball is behind this door. You made it. Let's do it. This has got to be, like, close to the end of the game. Let's examine the door. The doors lead to the great ballroom. Oh, no, it's Nimistop. My word, it's you. Who's there? You! You're one of those four. I'll be seeing you, my friend. Did you come to ruin the dance party, huh? Quiet. Oh, it's the princess. Princess? What is this ruckus? Sir Tingle is my guest. We're sorry. Stand down. Yes, ma'am. How did you fare, Sir Tingle? Please enter. All 
right, we're on to page 14 then, I guess. <laughs> That's page 13. Escape from jail and more traps. Lion and friends sacrifice themselves. What a sad day. But look at that picture of Tingle. It's amazing. Excuse me. Sir Tingle, is it? No. Oh. You are the final guest to arrive. Please help yourself to a drink at the bar. Someone's a ladybug there. Chapter one, the Chris of Kiss of Gratitude. Chris of Gratitude. Or the Chris of Angel. Um Okay. Oh, and Lovey is here, so this is gonna be like a datathon. Well, I mean, the thing is that we can always just fly back to previous chapters and we'll have them if we need them. So it's not even any more uh, difficult to backtrack. I don't, I can't imagine. We toast with soda. What on earth do you want? Don't come near me with that grimace. Blue lady. A lady wearing an eccentric outfit. Remind you of someone? Yeah, when you when you fly back to the previous chapters, you're literally literally traveling through time. So you go back to that point. So sometimes you have them, sometimes you don't. But it it's it's dependent on the chapter. So it you know, you have them if you need them. Basically whenever you go back to a previous chapter, uh, or a previous page rather, hey Muller Rife, you'll always have everything that you collected that you might need what have you missed we finished uh we finished getting through sneaking through the castle and we're now in the ballroom um bariki sacrificed herself to make a connection between a broken pair of broken wires uh and kakashi sacrificed himself uh, making a rope bridge and protecting us from a guard that was trying to cross said rope bridge all right so let's bang this blue lady Also, we murdered two guards. Like, just straight up murdered them. Um, okay, so, we're gonna need this paper. We're gonna need a real pen. So yeah, we're all on our own in the ballroom. So this is Blue Lady. I assume she'll need level three. Oh, how much cash do we have? No, the ladybug is with the Blue Lady here. I hope we have enough cash to be able to buy things. I guess it doesn't matter because you maintain your dating. So that's probably not a problem. Alright, so let's just give her this animal clock. It's a level 3, it's got 3 stats. What's this supposed to be? I want to laugh. I'll just look at your face. Not wrong level, is it? Oh, it's just two things that she hates. Okay. <laughs> Okay, well, that's something. At least we got that out of the way early. Food and pretty. We could do that, because... Okay, so that was one positive. Oh, okay, so we actually just got information there. Oh, look at this, it's okay, I guess. So that means we got one positive and one nothing, which means... Um... She is indifferent about pretty. She dislikes decoration and rarity. And she likes food. So we actually got a lot of information out of that one. But yeah, that was a pretty sick burn. <laughs> uh, okay, so we got some information there. So let's start with food then. We got this, which is food and mature. Find out if she likes mature. Uh, was that a one or a two positive? She might just be indifferent about mature. Oh no, it's two positive. Okay, so she likes mature as well. Uh, 
that means... Oh, that's level one, though. Shit, that's all of our food. Okay. So we know she doesn't like decoration, so we could go to... Style, perhaps? That's level... Oh, do we not have... An oh, we have a level three. There we go. Style, cool, and rarity. We know she dislikes rarity. We know she's indifferent about mature. We know she's indifferent about pretty. Or wait, no, hold on. No, I said indifferent about mature. She's not indifferent about mature. She's positive about mature. So this is a not a terrible one to go. Oh, that's only level two though. Style, pretty, and rarity. That's a negative overall. Or like style, pretty. Amateur. Actually, this is a really good one. Ah, uh, but it's only level two. Fuck. I assume she won't take level two. Maybe she will. Oh, she'll take level two. That's interesting, actually. Well, if you insist, I guess I'll have to. Next time, something less objectionable, please. Okay, so I was actually wasting some cash there. Uh, okay. So she's positive and negative and indifferent. So we know the indifferent is pretty. We know the positive is mature, so we know she dislikes style, unfortunately. I get the feeling here that the only thing she's gonna like is food. We could try tools. Uh, we don't have any tools, never mind. Try hobby. Hobby and rarity. We know she dislikes rarity. Hobby and gorgeous. Hobby and pretty, there we go. We know she's indifferent about pretty. Which means she's indifferent about hobby also. Well, if you insist, I guess I'll have to. Next time, something less objectionable, please. Yeah, so she's indifferent about hobby. This is gonna be a tricky one then. And yeah, we don't have any tools, so we basically can't go any for well, I guess I guess we can maybe just try and we can find out if she likes gorgeous. It seems like like an expensive way to do that, but Okay, so she likes gorgeous. Cause she's indifferent about pretty and a hobby, so gorgeous is the only thing that could have been positive there. It's okay, I guess. What about this microphone? Hobby and rarity. So we have all the information about that already. Hobby and gorgeous. We already have that. Hobby and mature. It's level one. I assume she won't take that, but that would theoretically be positive. I mean, let's just try. It's level one. It costs 18 bucks. Okay, yeah, no, she won't take level one. Can't possibly think I'd like something so crude. Better try again. Okay, so she'll take level two or level three. So let's go to Lavia. No, Lavia is literally right here, so we're actually in good shape. Now, hopefully, he'll actually have food available to us, or at least uh, tools, because we don't know about tools. Okay, he doesn't have any tools. Oh, fuck, he doesn't have tools or food. It's a pain in the ass. Because she doesn't like style, she doesn't like decoration. So that means we gotta work with hobby. Um, which is, I guess, fine if we can buy level two because we can still pick up some things that are mature, gorgeous hobbies. And also we could do things like this that's cool. We've got almost 6,000 rupees. Uh, so that's mature, so that'd be a one positive. Uh, gorgeous is a one positive. Rarity is a negative. Pretty and cool. We don't know, but we could pick that up to determine if she likes cool. I guess I already got the fruit basket. Ba hey, no, I didn't get the fruit bas basket. Oh, no, that's pretty. Hobby and cool. Yeah, okay, whatever. Hobby, pretty, and mature. I'd rather have mature and gorgeous. I guess we don't know about so we could go with these just in case. She doesn't like rarity, so that's just a waste of time. Hobby mature and gorgeous. That's gonna be too positive. 
Hobby and mature. Mm -hmm. Hobby and gorgeous. Hey Panda, you've missed so much. Thank you for the host, Marinius. Mature and gorgeous. Uh, yeah. Goals. <laughs> um, okay, so we got pretty and cool. That's... We don't know about cool, that's the problem. Um, mature and gorgeous. If we've got a level 3 mature and gorgeous. There we go, bottle liner. Hobby gorgeous and rarity. No. So we can, we can see what we know about, um... We can find out about coolness. <coughs> Love push. Have you seen any of this game? Oh yeah, I guess you've been here a few times, Panda. It's in the 50s and raining. Uh, oh yeah, so it was the game girl that I wanted to try, which is hobby and cool, because that's a cheap way of determining whether or not it's worth wasting our time with cool stuff. Oh boy. Oh, she does not like cool. What's this supposed to be? If I want to laugh, I'll just look at your face. Yeah, so she does not like cool. So this is a real bastard of a love push here. Because we can't buy food from this Lovia. I'm trying to think where we can buy food. I think we can buy food from Lovia in um, Vegetable Village. I think that's the only opportunity. So then, that means that we have to... The only things that we can give her are the things that are hobby, mature, and gorgeous, basically. And that's only a two positive. Oh, although, actually, that's pretty huge. Oh, yes! That's exactly what I wanted. So we might actually just be able to do this just with the things that we already have. Hobby and mature. Do we have another hobby, mature and gorgeous? Yeah, there we go. The level two love anthology. Okay, yeah, and then the and then the adult blocks should should seal the deal. And then hopefully our subsequent love pushes are gonna be a little bit easier here. Hobby and mature, that should be one positive and should be just enough. Perfect. Oh, look at this! It's okay, I guess. Alright, we got that heart from the blue lady. Oh, not bad. Such a gentleman, despite the face. <laughs> Here you go, your soda. Ah, thank you. Bartender. Hunt for him as well. Oh, but it's just... All guests toasts with this. All guests toast with the same drink. Just be quick about it. Are you perhaps Tingle? He's Tingle. It has to be you. My younger and elder sister. Both gave me your description. You look good. That's nice. That reminds me of Mister. My sister said you wanted to dance with the princess. No way. Now listen to me, the princess you see, she won't abide reckless dancing. Last year, Prince Seagal from the neighboring country tried to force her to dance and caused a ruckus. The princess slapped him. When the dance starts, find a proper partner. Dance flawlessly with four women at least. Then maybe the princess will ask you. No way. Let's empty our glasses and get to work. Uh, this fucker never gave me my drink. She bought me a drink. Have some soda. There we go. Got soda. I see you have your drink. Thank you for your patience. Sir Tingle has been handed a drink as well. Let the ball be- Oh, okay. I wanted to- I wanted to say, but it's okay. And let me just say my heartfelt thanks to the guests who came from afar, as well as the citizens here today. Thank you all. All right. Cheers. I own a targeted. Wait, fuck, where? I don't see her. Oh, wait, is that her? 
What? I'm so confused. Oh my god. There she is. Oh, motherfucker. Nimistoppas. I don't know, locking on. What? Oh. Okay. Lock on complete. God, what the fuck? What do you want? If you want to dance with Miss Iona, you'll first have to match my- Oh my god, are you gonna have a fucking dance off? <laughs> if you miss two moves during one dance, then that's it for you. Okay, my friend, let's dance. Okay. Hey, Muller Duck. You can't see my hands. You gotta bring them right in there. Yeah, apparently there's no timing. That makes it way easier. I was expecting it to be a whole timing thing. Hey, Rob. Ahem, <laughs> not bad. If you can follow this, you can have Iona. Oh, it's gonna speed up, though. Right, left, up. It's not the same. Fuck these guys. <laughs> Very well. You can dance with Iona for all I care. But how will she feel about it? That remains to be seen. To be fair, we've already screwed her three times. One, two, three. Love, love, dance. Tingle and Iona. Yeah, apparently that was it. I'm assuming we're gonna have to do that with all of them, though. <laughs> I, I have to just leave this up because... Change partners! Okay. I knew you would come. But this wasn't enough dancing for me. Oh, I guess that was Iona. Okay, so now we gotta find Laya, and it looked like she was right there. <laughs> it's you again. You want to steal Laya from me? Try to get match these fast moves. But if you miss two moves during one dance, I won't give you Laya. But wait, also, like, you have to fuck up two moves? I'm assuming this one's gonna be four long. To comprendre? Allez! Left, right, up, right. Well done. But how about this? Yeah, did he not... Uh, did he not have a dance-off with someone else? His dance moves are much more impressive. I doubt that. This is... These are some impressive dance moves right here. Up, right, left, up. Oh, no, okay. How? How are you able to match my moves? Harumph, all right, you can dance with Laya. How will Laya feel about it? One, two, three.
game is so weird. Tingle, I'm so happy to dance with you. Oh, if only we could stay like this forever. Please, big liar, stop time for us. I'm <laughs> trying to get his attention. You're right, shit. Well, we're going to have to do it for the the various uh, people that we have wooed throughout the game. She was up here somewhere, wasn't she? I thought I saw her before. Where are you, train lady? Ah, oh, there she is. I actually saw Nimistop before her. Lock on complete. You! Again, it's you! I have no intention of giving you Azusa. You'll never match my max moves. If you miss two moves in one dance, it's over. Come on, this will be over quickly. Okay, these ones are going to be crazy fast. I suspect also five long. Up, right, left, right, left. Gotcha. Okay, okay. You can dance with Azusa. But whether... Wait, I only had to do one of those? Whether you can win her heart. I say she'll have none of you. Why did I only have to do that once? That wasn't even, like, any harder. I'm disappointed that all these dances are the same. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, but I mean, the next one will probably, it'll probably only be six, right? Like, probably? You kept your promise. You're a real go-getter. Oh, is it time already? Don't leave yet. All right, we gotta find Sensei. There she is. Why do you keep hounding me? However, this will be our final match. If you miss two moves, you lose. Prepare for my final footwork. <laughs> It's gonna be like 10 longer. Left, up, right, left, up, right. Right, up, shit. I may have fucked that up. Oh no, actually, I think I got. Oh, nope. Ha ha ha, deeply funny. You missed three times. See you next year. Oh, is that going to be a fucking game over? I assume I just have to start from that phase. Okay, good. It's a baby's game. Uh, I saw her, and then I lost her. Yeah, apparently I uh, did not get that at all correct. Why do you keep pounding me? I'm gonna cheat a little bit here. However, this will be our final match. If you miss two moves, you lose. Prepare for my final footwork. Up, left, right, left, right, up. Oh, okay, well, that one's easy. I really hope I didn't fuck that up in terms of, uh... Okay, now I got it right. <laughs> Did you get a green dress? 
Wah, you win the final dance. Don't worry about me, my friend. Rather, worry about yourself. Will this lady dance with you? She sure as shit will. Rock shake breakfast. Finish. Yeah, I'm sure he did. A time when we looked at the ocean. What a perfect moment in time that was. <laughs> the princess awaits. Go, Tingle. Stand down, guards. Sir Tingle. So glad you came. <laughs> Negative Princess Peach dress. Well done, Sir Tingle. Dance skills are an important thing. It appears my daughter has something to tell you. Please hear her out. Father, I want everyone to hear this. Very well, as you wish. Yeah, they were <laughs> stood down already. Guests from near and far. Once again, I'm very grateful. You all came to the ball. The day before yesterday, out of the blue, I fell prey to an unknown illness. I might have had to sleep forever. However, yesterday, this man Tingle visited me, bringing a miracle medicine. He rescued me from the brink of oblivion. Tingle, would you like to greet everybody? Nah, but yeah, actually, I do. Yeah, we totally just, uh, like, got in all of those ladies' good books just to get to the princess. Each year, we all meet at this ball and celebrate the day of my father's enthronement. I also understand that it serves to find a husband for me, his heir. <laughs> Especially the dance moves, the, the whole dancing thing. That was definitely real. Cough. I have come to a decision. The king has been poisoned. The person who saved my life. Sir Tingle. He is fit to be my husband. <laughs> the king is not having it. Her husband? She <laughs> feet without a dance. Uh, Amara. This is very sudden. How about you sleep on it? Oh, yeah, she already did that. No, Father, I've made up my mind. Wait, Amara. <laughs> it's not that I think he's a bad guy or anything. How can I put it? Um. <laughs> and to express my gratitude to this hero, I will give him a kiss right here and now. That also that those hands were not also the hands were not aiming for like shoulders or anything or like I guess around the waist, but the mouth definitely was not either. Not for the face. <laughs> what what was that? <laughs> what? <laughs> Fucking Metroid <laughs> reference out of nowhere? <laughs> Wait, also what? Latex, rubber, couch, shoot. I don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> Conclusion, a disguise. What is the meaning of this? What? Yes, that was, she came in as a fucking morph ball and then it made the, the like Samus entrance music. Yeah! Huff, puff, tingle, you okay? This guy here spilled the beans. <laughs> Uh, because you manhandled me, you animal. Loosen these bonds at once. 
<laughs> using protection. <laughs> okay, that's unvulcanized natural rubber. Obviously, ever who doesn't know that? That over there, or wait, that over there is that's not the princess. Reveal yourself, witch. Witch. Witch, the queen of the neighboring country. Guards, guards, throw out those wicked people. Here comes fucking Straw Boy. Yay, I made it just in time. Mister, everyone, you're all here. You all right, miss? <laughs> Completely recharged. Functioning within normal parameters. Lion, you're here too. Yay! Hey, you. Mister, I landed softly because I'm made of straw. Drop a house on her. Yeah, sounds like a good plan. The wind blew me through the princess's window. And there... <gasps> uh, Mara. Yeah, this is. We've got to be coming up on the final, final like, the end of this game, like final f boss fight or whatever. My education advisor, Miss M, or should I say, Miss Witch? What is going on here? A rumph. Every year at this ball. You're surrounded by thick-headed men. Some of that must have rubbed off on you. Someone rubbed off on her. You! Do you know what pheromones are? Pheromones? They're a kind of life energy. They can make it so that I never age. My magic power will never dwindle. The city won't stand before me. Guards! Seize! Seize! Oh, shit. Father! Lady Witch, what's happening? Toasting is an important part of celebrating, no? Oh, shit, she totally poisoned everyone. She's a mummy. Hey, Deceptive. Maybe he shouldn't have. Too bad. Poison! Lady Witch, please! We have no such thing as pheromones. Hee <laughs> hee Hashtag poisoned. Ha ha ha! Listen well, Amara. They are born of delusional feelings. Delusional feelings? When an unpopular man thinks he's popular! <laughs> <laughs> walks around dreaming about the unreachable. Oh my God. <laughs> Men who harbor such solutions, <laughs> they just use those pheromones. <laughs> oh, well, that's about the gist of it. <laughs> well then. <laughs> this man is the result of my labor. <laughs> 35-year-old <laughs> bachelor, an unattractive, unemployed geek, the subject I have been looking for so long. <laughs> Sir Tingle? <laughs> all those presents! <laughs> it was all a trap? I only created the right circumstances. And now, stop interfering. I want to taste the fruits of my labor. <laughs> the ripe and sweet fruits. What are you doing? Oh, I see. Wait, what? Why did she just... She can teleport, I guess? It's a trap. Watch and learn. Now, now, calm down. Now, listen, I only want the pheromones. I will return to my home with Seagal. How about it, Tingle? Just give, give me a taste. Oh, I bet you want to taste Tingle's pheromones. It won't hurt a bit. Try to taste for the princess's life? Think about it. I'll be waiting. Oh, that's the final portal to the final boss fight. Darn it. If that woman gets her hands on pheromones, she might gain enough magic power to overthrow the government of Emerald City. We can't change that. Let's go after her. 
Tingle, you stay here. Huh? Why not take him along? Huh? Well, you see... Pheromones? Pheromones are life energy. If Tingle loses them, his life will be gone. Guy Fieri Mons? Guy Fieri Moans? They're Guy Fieri Moans. Oh, I understand. Okay, but Miss Bariki? <laughs> Not sure she's really a bad guy. We'll see him again, won't we? I have concluded that we will see him again. Yay! So that's how it is. Tingle, you keep an eye on this place. Let's go. Okay, so they're going through. Let's cure the king, right? Because we should be able to do that. <laughs> I can see your message, Deceptive, if you're wondering if we can't see your message. No chat was showing up. That's weird. Use the miracle medicine. Oh. Oh. Sir Tingle. What? Amara's been kidnapped. <laughs> and he's out again. Oh. He's having some pheromones. Oh, can I not go past there? I wanted to go back and save. Uh. All right. Oops. Well, I did not click where I meant to click. <sighs> Let's examine it. A magic circle that witch made. It resembles the one that pulled you into the book. Let's do it. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay. Hey there, blue lady. Typical. All the guards suddenly collapsed. How very unfortunate. Don't you think, dear ladybug? Absolutely. I know, right? <laughs> Sail in my portal. But now is not the time to talk of such things. Tingle, dear. Listen to me for a moment before leaving. Which is pretty stubborn. Let me see that slingshot for a second. Thanks. For just spitting all over my... All over my slingshot. Teehee, presto. Charming. Okay, I assume we got an upgraded... Tingle Slingshot has been powered up with the power of spewed up uh, soda. Leave everything here to us. Good luck. Good luck. Oh, shit's about to get real. Tingle! You came. Just like Miss Bariki said. Oh, there she is. We meet again. Again, mister. Ah, ha, ha. How about that? He really came. Good things do come to those who wait. Stop it. You won't get Tingle. But you will return the princess. That sounds like a bad deal. Just do it. Well now, such determination. Such strength of will. <laughs> Tingle is great at coming. That is true. I think for this, I'll need a snack. Wait, oh! <laughs> it's that guy. Mr. Sigma! He isn't anything like Tingle. But it's enough to refresh my pheromones a little. Correct. Hey, you, what did you do? <laughs> Pheromone! <laughs> Rejuvenation! Oh shit. 
This is the power of pheromones. But I still want tingles. Oh well, I can take you on like this. Come, attack whenever you're ready. Give me a save point. Darn. How you tingle? Delusions can be so powerful. Can't you make use of that somehow? Try to imagine something. Hunt. <laughs> Tingle is filled with power from the girls' hearts. Oh, okay. So the I I guess we probably we didn't need to have full hearts. I guess. No, we we didn't have an opportunity because after after we saved her. There was no... We weren't able to get back into her... Uh, we weren't able to get back into her chambers. And so we never had an opportunity to date her again. So I don't know what the deal is with that. I don't know how you get five hearts with her. Tingle is filled with power from the girl's hearts. Oh, I don't know what's happening, but whoa. Get on my back, guys. Let's combine forces. Here we go! Oh my god. Energy sucking, cunning master of summoning, witch. Look at that slingshot though. <laughs> Foolish tingle, you won't have to suffer. This is my domain, resistance is useless. The pheromones amassed inside you. Hee hee, I'm gonna savor them. <laughs> Evaluating effectivity of renewed slingshot. <laughs> Capability of damaging witch's body detected. Do you think the face is gonna change as we pull back on? This game is basically bad porn. Leave, oh, leave navigation to me. You go all out attacking. Mister, I'll be close by at any time. So is this going to basically just be, um, sort of like the end boss? From the first game? Is that doing anything? Oh shit, what the fuck? Seems to be a, that seems to be a hard spot, mister. Oh, we gotta shoot it in the mouth. That's what he said. How long will he hold out, I wonder? Here come the stingers. Oh, shit. Oh shit, okay. Am I actually doing anything? Here, let this one suck you up. Are we in a vagina? Accept your fate. Oh, cover the right side.
I don't know if... Oh, shit. It looks like it's getting sad to me as I shoot it in the face more, so... Okay, there we go. Oh, wait. She has a health bar underneath her. I was looking at this thing at the top. That's my health, isn't it? But no, she has a small health bar underneath her. I hadn't even noticed that one. I just saw the big one at the top. It's like, why isn't this doing anything? Getting a little sad here now. Got her. At least the slingshot isn't making the shocker. That's true. How much longer are you going to struggle? Now the question is, are there gonna be multiple phases here or or is this health bar it? Because if this health bar is it, then this is going to be easy. And, like, this has got to be the last boss fight, right? How long will you hold out, I wonder? Yeah! <laughs> no, no, my health bar is at the top of the screen. There's a health bar underneath her. How far behind are you guys? My health bar was the one at the very top. She had a little health bar underneath. Mister, I can feel it. The bad lady is coming at us again. Okay, so there's a second phase. Anti-aging, middle-aged woman, witch. Please don't listen to me. Tingle, I underestimated you. I sense my sister's magic on your slingshot. Oh... But that's not all. So many women lent you their power. More than that, your friends are with you. You people make me sick. I expected to fight only the bratty protagonist. This isn't funny anymore. Tingle! I will consume all of you. Also, nice. Wait, also... Okay, I was wondering if... I assume we got it. Uh, okay, not shoot. We only gotta shoot her. This is it. Oh, fuck. Mister! Hitting the princess will get you in trouble. Yeah, I figured that. But I assume that I have to... Oh, I see. I gotta just... That'll give me hearts. Or extra life, rather. I don't know... I... It doesn't seem like Neanderthal. It doesn't seem like hitting the pictures of her do damage, but I uh, suspect that. Oh yeah, here we go. If I let them go, then yeah, they will. Um, uh, 
they'll grow and do damage or something. as well. Makes this a little tricky. I mean, it's not like ridiculously tricky, but shit, shit. But it's, you know, it's just a little awkward here. Oh, we're getting close. The circle is closing in, shit. <laughs> I've only got a small area that I can easily shoot the heart. I was gonna hit the princess that time. Come on. There we go. Ah! Breaking her, yeah. Breaking her heart, literally. Is, is it over? Once I got into the groove there, I was really easy. It was really easy to hit them when they were coming up on the left hand side. Hostile behavior has ceased. Yeah, I'm, I'm not entirely certain if there's going to be a phase three. Hey, won't you finish? Oh, her? Oh, yeah, I can. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah! I guess maybe I could have left her. Oh, I wonder if I I wonder if I fucked up. I wonder if I just got a negative ending by killing her. I wonder if I could have left her. Is she dead? Hmm? Hey Tingle, heads up. We can catch the princess here. Should have given her a present. Wait, what? Oh, he <laughs> tore off the rope. I was like, what the fuck did she just rip off or just like tore off her clothes or something? Are you all right? Yes. Sorry that I made you worried. We're glad you're not hurt. By the way, what are we gonna do with her? How to make sure she won't do anything bad again? Should we do away with her? No. Please. You. Uh, I'm not entirely certain what we'll be playing next. Um, because I. Well, let, let's discuss that once we get to credits or something here. Darn, darn! I should have stopped her at the very beginning. Both of us, we were such fools. Seriously, Gaul. Why did she do this? Quiet. Uh, quiet. You too. You too may turn out like that one day. My mother. She used the power of men's delusions. Just so she could feel young again for a while. Who can blame her? You, mother. All women. Okay, so they're turning this around to all of a sudden here. You all live off the delusions of man. Okay, well, <laughs> Tingle, 
You understand that too, don't you? You and me. We're all the, we're the same after all. Just as mother and the princess. All women are the same. Sir Seagal. I'm going to make that a little bit more objectionable. Is everyone safe and sound? Your freshman roommate is in this game. No damages. Huh, I survived again somehow. Yay! You did well. Alright, see you, Deceptive. And you're still in one piece. That's good to see. I worried so. You worried entirely too much. By the way, where's my troubled little sister? I mean, yeah, she did mention that she was her sister earlier, didn't she? A uh, sister? She's still on the other side, yes? Hup! I almost had it. Almost! Ah, my magic circle! Mama, you have to stop! Oh, that was him. Mama, you have to stop! Or wait, no, what? Who said that? Yeah, that must have been him. What a troubled parent and child. Some chastisement is in order. Hop, hop! Sister! Let me out! You can think about what you've done in there. For that purpose, I was sent here by our big sister. I'm very sorry, Tingle, for the trouble our witch caused you. I apologize to you too, Princess. No need. I'm, instead, I feel like I should thank you. What a very grateful princess. Graceful princess. I've already healed the guards and guests. I'll leave the rest to you. Give my regards to the king. Ta-ta. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh my. Father. Father, are you all right? You should be. I saved him earlier. I guess so, yeah. Just leave that locked up in the throne room here. Or in the ballroom. Ugh. Wait, wait. Did, did I faint? Wait. So that's what happened. Wait, wait. I was poisoned, but then Tingle. Wait, wait. And then Amaro was kidnapped. Wait. Oh. Wait, wait. Witch. Wait. Amaro, what happened to Witch? She's over there. Hmm, what are you looking at? Sir Tingle and his friends saved us from her. I see. You have my gratitude, Sir Tingle. Uh, excuse me, King? Hmm, yes? We have something to... We have to come to ask something of you. Hmm, I see. Well then, let's hear it. Yes, okay, well... Ah, they're gonna get their Wizard of Oz things. We've come to the city to meet you, King. Each one of us is lacking something. We humbly ask you to bestow it upon, bestow it on us. That's what you do, right? Wait, wait. Uh, wait, wait. isn't that only an urban legend? Excuse me. <laughs> People go to the city and ask a favor. <laughs> I have heard this from Kakashi. Wait, wait, wait. I don't know who spread that story. Your voices are amazing. Eh, really? It's only a story. Wait, wait. I'll hear you out. So what is it you wish for? I I want courage. Heart. I want to be well behaved and smart. Hmm. He went through my guard without fear. To rush to the aid of your friends. You think you need to ask an old man for courage? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Without being given orders of your own free will, wait, wait. you uncovered Witch's plot and saved Tingle. 
A machine woman possessed by such deep feelings. How could she ask for more heart than that? Although you're a small and weak doll, you escaped Seagal and Witch's scheme and saved my daughter twice. You can be proud of that. Fuck pants. Courage. Compassion. Wisdom. Each of you holds all these qualities. Sir Tingle. Crotchless and assless, maybe? You have some wonderful friends there. Uh, oh, are we going back to our reality? Hmm? What was that? <laughs> Mister! Tingle! Wait! Strategically place zippers or velcro. Are you alright, lady? Well, you can buy those on AliExpress, then. Uh, I can guarantee you that. I've definitely encountered those um, when I was trying to find my Tingle outfit. Uh, I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> Are you alright, lady? Oh, 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 this is bad. King, it's been a long time. Yes. So that's your sister over there. Did you know about this? No, 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 absolutely not. I only caught a glimpse telling us Tingle's fortune. Tingle, dear. You listened to my fortune telling. And did what I told you, isn't that right? King, everyone. If Tingle wants to return to his own world, we have almost no time left. Now I'll tell you, zippers seem to be more popular than Velcro. His, his own world? What does that mean? I'll explain later. We must leave right now. Take a deep breath. Here we go. Hup. <laughs> now we're in a clickable world here. Hey, there's Lion. Edible. Hey, Tingle. You're fine. What a relief. There are people over there. They're gonna just be freaked the fuck out by this giant talking lion. Oh, it's, uh... To feed Barkle. <laughs> hiya, hiya. Auntie wants to talk to you. A ladybug reunion. No way, you know my brother? Well, now's not the time to talk about that. Auntie wants to talk to you, I think. Oh, hi. Long time no see, you came a long way. Hey, bloody. Uh, well, we were framed and they thought that we like vandalized the city. <laughs> Already eaten my body. Oh, no need to worry so much. Hey, auntie wants to talk to you. I'll get over my bed wedding. Just wait and see. Tingle, you've traveled to many places. You've given your very best. Which gave you trouble, but in the end, all that, le all that led to your being here. I think it was fate. That's why I chose to give you the balloon. That special red balloon. Tingle. All the others are waiting over there. Go to them. We're heading home. See ya, old timer. Oh, that was the ladybug. Bye, mister. Till next time. Yeah, the bad wedding bug. I I don't know how to get all the princess's hearts. In, unless I could have dated her there before I talked to the king? Ugh. Where are we? Don't worry, little feller. Scary part is over. Oh, Bariki, you scared me. Power spot discovered ahead. Tingle. The pink magic user is calling for you. Oh, let's go, Tingle. 
We're all safe and sound. That's what matters. Whippets. Who's doing whippets? This man has collapsed. Isn't there something wrong with this place? Oh, yes. You arrived when she said... When she said you would. You were unconscious. I see. But she used these magic circles to summon Tingle from another world. Is it true, King? He came from somewhere else? Into our world? It seems that way. Really? That means... You go, go back? You'll leave this world? No, lion. Mister won't leave this world. He'll be with us. Like he has been all this time. I don't think you understand, Kakashi. You are dumb as shit. My dear Kakashi, listen to me. You're really dumb. This mister of yours, he came from a world that is different from ours. That's why he must return to his own world. Uh, I don't understand. Oh, Kakashi. <laughs> Change in atmospheric pressure detected. Possibility of storm and earthquake. Leaving this location is recommended. Very clever machine friend. We mustn't leave. This is important. This is his only chance. No, this is a storybook world. All different people belong in another world. This is his only chance. Very soon the magic circle will open. That will be your way back home. It's true. He'll really leave. Wait. This isn't as he prophesied, is it? You told him he would dance with me. That is the key to his return, is it not? Yes, that's what I said. But him and me haven't yet done the... Tingle and I haven't shared a dance yet. But up until now, my predictions were pretty accurate. And that's why... But Amara, Tingle is... Quiet, father. This man, Tingle... He's a hero. He saved the city from a wicked witch. If he wishes so, he has the right. Yeah. It's a bit of a horizontal dance. To stay in the world he himself saved. That's right, Tingle. You don't have to leave. Mr. Tingle. 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 That's right, he doesn't have to go home. Hmm. Listen, everybody. Let's have another dance. Right here and now. A dance? The princess I saw Tingle dance with was really a disguised witch. The princess of Tingle's heart. Or the actual princess. Oh, shit. The dance partner. <laughs> Tingle, you decide. Oh no! I have to pick. Tingle. There's little time left, I'm afraid. There's only time for one last dance. Choose a partner. Ah, oh, shit. Train gear. Train girl's clearly best. Have you decided on a partner? Let's be real. Very good. Tingle, take her hand. Now you two. Walk slowly into the center of the circle. Mister! Look! <laughs> yeah, but she said the princess of our heart. The magic circle! <laughs> Let's 
strong outpour of energy particles detected. Abnormal event imminent. Very soon now. Huh? What'll happen very soon? Wait, who said that? Uh, hey! <laughs> I changed my mind? Why the birds... The birds have stopped singing. Sweet Donk Kashi. <laughs> Space deformation detected. Tingle, can you hear me? Oh, this is important. Please listen. Which is magic is weakening. It'll be enough to get you home. However, there's a way to reverse its effect. A thing that witches can't do. Oh shit, there goes everyone else. They're all gone. Decision is made final. And what is that? <laughs> to reach someone by thinking about them. Each of you can accomplish that. It's a special kind of magic. Tingle, do you hear me? Tingle, answer. I don't know who's talking at this point. If there are forces holding you back, or if it is your wish, Heights man. Don't worry about me, okay? Trains are the most important thing to me. I'll be fine, like before, if you leave. Totally okay with that. I'm not sad. I won't cry. Oh, ah, don't be stupid. Stay or leave? Don't go, Tingle! Tingle! Don't go! Stay here, mister! Park will be fine. He's got a corpse to eat. Page cleared! A miracle happened! Tingle stayed! The light was red, so he never departed. Author, Astro. Oh, they didn't translate the credits? I mean, I guess these are just people's names, probably? I mean, I guess that's fine. Yeah, I'm assuming these are everyone's names. It's kind of weird, actually, that they didn't translate the credits. I mean, like, it'd be fine if they left the names, but, like, if they translated the, like, the titles, like, the jobs, you know, like, uh, assistant director or whatever. Yeah, that was an interesting game. I don't know... I don't know if I like it more than the first one. It's... It's so different, it's hard to actually compare it to the first one. Maybe you get all the girls if you get all the hearts? Maybe. Train Maniac Express, Azusa Mark II. Oh my god, that dancing guy in the corner. Yeah, maybe the maybe that's not even like uh, text that's drawn on as text, yeah. First one is literally the best game ever made. Yeah, I, I think the first one is better also. It's more this is more like a like a visual novel style thing. I just don't think they can get as uh, as much out of that out of that concept. I like this was a really good game, but yeah, I think the, the first one is a little bit better. I don't think this one would have as much replayability. I think that's the thing. Shitty Leisure Suit Larry game. Oh 
don't know, the thieves got... Or one of the thieves got locked up. Making game around map making. <laughs> I mean, the first one was sort of map making themed because you had to mark the, or it was at least partially you had to make the maps because uh, the first game you had to at least mark uh, like highlights on the map, like points of interest, which was a neat concept. The, yeah, the first one has so many cool things. Oh, Lion is the king of the the guards, and wait, baby, Lion Kid over there. Oh, they put up a monument for the uh, or a memorial for the dead miners. Kashi is now the official scarecrow for this cornfield. Oh shit, he's got a slingshot. Oh, who do we have a picture of? Ah, oh. So I assume that would obviously be different depending on who you picked at the end. I wonder, I wonder what would have happened if we had said leave. I wonder what that would have changed. Oh shit, you know what I just realized? The lady who was on the TV at the start of the game selling the book was Miss Witch. I mean, it makes sense, but like, <laughs> guess we'll never know. Tingle got lost item. Looks like a vacuum tube or something. You can now read the book at game start. Save data up to here. Okay. Should I save it in a second s slot? Yeah. Oh, can we can can we continue or is it a new is or is it a new game plus? You know what's weird? There's that mic test at the main menu here, but I swear we only had to use the mic like one time in this game. So let's just see what happens if we open this up. Oh, read the book is an option. Let's read the book before we continue here. Okay, so this just lets us see all of this. <laughs> Okay, but yeah, so what happens if I... What happens if I actually start this? Excuse me, Sir Tingle, is it? Please help yourself to drink at the bar. So we just... That's weird. But yeah, so we have... So this is like a continuation, like, just from just before the end, but now... So, uh, so there this must be the opportunity for us to... I'm just wondering if we can go past here now. No. Another 
of shit do I get? More hearts to the princess. I, I don't think she would need a vacuum tube. God, I don't know why we would need to give her that. Piece of a machine with unknown function. Oh, well, Blue Ladybug is looking for this. Fine. Before we s stop, since, since it's only like 10 o'clock here, uh, we can go give this to the Blue Ladybug. What was that that we dropped? I'm assuming that the blue ladybug is back at the fortune teller's house. That's where most of them were, right? For a second I was thinking, oh yeah, in fact, blue ladybug's in the picture. So yeah, as for what to play next, um, so I was slightly expecting this game to be a little bit longer and like maybe I'd finish it like tomorrow maybe it stops you from wetting the bed um so the thing is that the new Kirby game comes out on uh Friday I have that pre-ordered but chances are given my experience with Amazon I probably won't have it on Friday um so we'll have to play that by ear. No, I've got a list of things to play. Like, I got a shit ton of things to play. But um, my point is that with the Kirby game coming out on Friday, I probably don't want to pick something super long to start uh, before then. So I'll, I'll have to look through my list and pick something. I, we could even do um, uh, Kirby Superstar, maybe. Did you find our youngest brother? Your face tells me all I need to do. Because we could probably beat Kirby Superstar in, like, two streams. That is not a hard game. Second annual Eevee concert. I do have Kirby 64, but it's not on my current list of games to play. Or, actually, I don't remember where it is exactly in terms of my list. I have my lists. I've got lists. Uh, yeah, I don't... Uh, Kirby 64 is on my far, far future list, so it's on the next batch of games to play. Where did you find that? Oh well, thank you. Put it into the radio, that makes sense for a vacuum tube. Phew, it's finally fixed. Looks like speedrun I won't beat super, Superstar in six hours? I don't know, I... Superstar's not a long game. Is this just a... Oh, it's, so this is just a... I like that it uses the same head banging anim animation as from the end there. Um, so this is just sound test. I'm so confused. Yeah, so it's a sound test, yeah. But I'm confused as to what the deal is with this heart one. Ripening selection. Tingles, 35 years old. Are these all going to be remixes from the first game? I don't know. Whatever. That's a sound test, so that's not all that exciting. Um, okay.
So... Tingle, my dear. Do you wish to hear the balloon lesson again? No. So we don't really have anything else to do here. I mean, we could we could go do some secrets, although I don't know what any of the rest of the secrets are at this point. Um, but yeah, I mean, we got this game done here now, so I think that's pretty much it for this game. Like, I don't think there's much more we can do today. I'm gonna save, I suppose. I guess I could save over the uh, original save file, but I'm gonna save it onto save two here again. I mean, we'd have to go through that entire end boss fight because when we go back to that chapter, we're um, before the ball even starts. So we'd have to do all the dance segment again. We'd have to do uh, the actual last boss fight. We'd have to go through all that cutscene again. Uh, and, you know, and then we'd have to pick the next one. And then we'd have to go back, do it all over again. So, I mean, seems like a lot of work. <laughs> So yeah, I think I think I'm just gonna call it there. I think that's um, good enough. We finished this game and uh, yeah, so we'll continue with uh, or we'll start something tomorrow. Maybe uh, Kirby Superstar. I'll look and see if maybe I've got something more appropriately length, but. I think that's probably good enough um, in terms of length. Any, anyway, we can always stop that part way through because it's nicely segmented um, and then do the new Kirby game. So yeah, we will stop there. Thank you for watching and good night.